Um, no, thank you. Good morning. I'm feeling bright today. I'm feeling surprisingly chipper. Today is fun. Today we're going on a little day trip, you and I. Please ignore this. It's really annoying how it's right in frame, but like, I'm not gonna take it down. So, today is rather exciting. We will be having a little day together, you and I. Um, we're going to London. Honestly, I do not go to London that much, considering it's not that far off, but it's, it's like an hour and three quarter train ride-ish. So, you know, it's a little bit of a way, but like, it's not terribly far, but I don't really ever go because it's like, I don't need to. But I really wanted to go shopping in London. Um, and I was meant to be going to London this week anyway, but plans changed and I thought, fuck it, I'm still gonna go. My train is at 9.36. It's 8.54 and you may be like, you're staying on quite early. Uh, normally I would not leave this early, but I want to try and get coffee before if I can, because I'm gonna be sitting on the train for like, you know, an hour hour and a bit so I wanted something to sip on. The weather today is a bit cold but not like terribly cold and also I feel like walking around shops you get hot because they're always like over stimulatingly warm in shops so I have got a long sleeve on and this jacket and I've got my scarf as well which doesn't really match. Honestly, last night I was considering making a scarf to match my outfit. And I love that I can fucking say that, like, mm, I'm going to make a scarf for tomorrow that might match my outfit. But, like, didn't have time. It's rather bright this morning. I'm actually going to put my sunnies on. I genuinely think that, like, once you get to, like, a certain age, like, you should be expected to do a driving test, like, you know, every 15 years or something. Because things change, okay? The way I drive is going to be different to a 70 year old granny drives um and like good for her honestly like if she doesn't understand the roundabout that's not her problem that's my problem and like she's like yeah deal with it bitch and i do deal with it in an angry manner i don't know who this hypothetical granny is but like honestly she's a girl boss and i i'm like her biggest fan welcome to starbucks can we get a pizza today hi can i please get a grande ice brown sugar oat shake and espresso please Sounds good to me. Anything else? No, it's everything. Thank you. Perfect. Drive around. Cheers. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers. Okay, can we talk about character development? Last time I came through this darn driveway when filming, I had to do sneak attack stealth mode camera. Also, I realised that, like, I'm... He doesn't care. <laughs> like, what I'm doing with my day, like, he does not care. Like, he probably thinks, oh, like, I was filming myself, or oh, weirdo. But, like, does it, like, am I going to be embarrassed because of that? No, because I don't know this man personally, and if he wants to judge me, that's his own decision. Oh my god, why is that, like, so philosophical? No, but, like, the concept around, like, embarrassment around people. You're, most likely, you're never going to see a lot of these people ever again in your life, so why do you give a shit about what they think of you at that point? me i'm literally i should buy a book anyway i feel like we're on good time i've got 26 minutes to get to the station bearing in mind it will literally take me five minutes to drive there from here and five minutes to walk there from my car so the tickets that i've bought means i'm only eligible for that specific train that i've paid for because they're cheaper Every other time they're completely fine. Just been to Brandy. So I literally just got like comfy stuff. I went, went in there for jeans, but like they didn't have any like nice ones because I wanted like a light wash. But that's okay. 
um, into Oxford Street now because that's where most of the shops are. So to remedy my issue, I had to buy some plasters, sit down and put them on my feet and my skin has peeled off my heels. So that's just really good. Um, so I'm a little comfortable. I have to walk half an hour enough to the train station because I'm not trying a bus again. There was so much traffic and I really don't want to miss my train because I thought about getting an Uber but I don't have the same traffic issue so that's so fucking random. I'm literally just waiting. Did you get photographed? I'm literally just waiting at a crossing outside Buckingham Palace. And then the king drives past? Sorry. Huh? What are the fucking chances? I was like about to complain because I was like, oh, I need to hurry and get my train. Okay then, that's just so fucking random. I don't really give a shit about my family, but it's quite cool, so yeah. Gosh, we are back in the comfort of my car. I'm so tired. My feet kill. Normally I'm a very fast walker. I was literally hobbling and putting my hands up to this one because I feel grimy. I'm actually going to be having dinner at my nan's this evening and I was going to go straight there, but I feel gross. So I'm actually going to go home first, give you guys a little haul, get showered, wash my hair, and then head out to hers. I also have my bestie staying the night, which I'm rather excited about because I haven't seen her like. Oh, nearly two weeks, honestly. Oh my god, I just want to sit for a second. When I got back to my car, a bird had shit on my door handle. Not very slay. Some bird went dookie on my door handle. I cannot wait to take my shoes off later. I saw the King of England today. That's so random. I'm not necessarily the biggest fan of the royal family. Like, I'm not one of these people that like loves them. Like, I think that it's cool that we have like a, a king. It like sounds grand, but like I don't really care. I feel like maybe that experience was wasted on me, but it's still cool. I'm gonna tell my nan when I see her this evening and she'll be quite impressed, I think, because she kind of likes them. I really didn't get that much stuff and I'm desperate for a pee and I really wanna get showered, but I may as well show you before I get showered, because why not? I'm excited. Plus I wanna put some of the stuff on after. Okay, from Brandy, I actually got three things. I'm actually pissed off because I went in there to buy some jeans because I saw some on the website that I really wanted and I was like, oh, perfect. I'll go get them in Brandy today when I'm there rather than ordering them. They didn't have the jeans. I did try on a pair which were quite nice. They were like low-waisted, dark wash, but I already had a pair of jeans that color. So I was like, don't need them. So I just got comfy stuff because they do my favorite joggers and that's another reason why I went there with some more joggers. So first of all, I got these, which are like the wide leg ones which I don't own any of the wide leg ones from Brandy, but I feel like it like a Pilates yoga mum with them. Really comfy, 10 out of 10. I just got grey joggers, but they're really fucking soft and I don't own grey joggers. So if I'm gonna get grey joggers, I'm obviously gonna get my faves, which are these. They These ones are the cuffed ones though. I already have two pairs of the cuffed ones. So I thought I'd add to the collection. They're so soft. This little t-shirt, I just saw it as I was about to go pay. And I was just like, it's really cute. Normally I'm a crop girly because I love the crops from Brandy Melville, but this is like an actual t-shirt length, which I didn't try it on, so I don't know how it would look. I guess cute, but it's got like little teddy bears reading a book on. It's kind of like a rogue decision, but I wanted to go into Tiger and then I just happened to walk past it. I was like, slay, let me go in there. I got this little tote bag because I have one from Tiger, but it's like less of a good quality than this. And it was only 2 50 and my one's on the ropes a bit. So I got this. Then I got this, which is a tripod for your phone with a light behind it. I thought it'd be quite good if I'm, you know, re-emerging re my vlogging era. So I got that, although it needs batteries. So I was trying to use it on the train and realized it needs batteries. Then I went to Primark because I wanted just to look at the bikinis and stuff because I've been going on holiday in a couple months and I wanted to just look at a few bits for holiday. So I really just got basics. So I got this little, 
I put it on a kind of funny. It's just the asymmetric off the shoulder top, but it's like the really tight, stretchy material. Then I got two bikini tops. They're the exact same style. So good for holiday. So I got this orange one. Then I got the same one in white. They were £2.50 each. So I'm like, they're fine. I like them because they're flattering on my boobs. And then the last thing from Primark, I just got some more claw clips because I lose these all the time. They're kind of ugly, but like if the, all of the color combinations were ugly, so I kind of just had to deal with it. And then I got my trusty plasters, which haven't really done much because my feet still really hurt. Here's my outfit, by the way. So I have these jeans from weekday on. There's some straight leg ones. I've got my platform docks. I've got this little top, which I don't even know where it's from. It is stinky, I must tell you, because I have been so hot. My little jacket was this little Sherpa that I thrifted for two pounds. Um, and then my scarf was one that I made. Anyway, let's enjoy this religious experience. Oh. oh my God. It's actually criminal how like much relief I'm feeling. I'm putting up my shades to cover up my eyes. I'm heading downtown. I'm at my, 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 I'm solo. The little wispies, the baby has... I don't know if I want the red velvet. Well, they may have some more invigorating flavours. So we've picked up Ellie, who's had some food, and now we're in the supermarket getting some snacks. I'm watching Darren Chris TikToks. There's not really much to report, to be honest. I think we're probably nodding off to bed soon. Um, so, yeah, I think I'm going to sign off. If you did enjoy this video, give it a thumbs up. And I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.